Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I want to talk to you a little bit about the Stila Longwear Liquid Lip Color. Um, I'm wearing one of the colors today. I just filmed a tutorial. Um, check in the down bar for a link to uh, the step-by-step -step for this look. Um, but I wanted to talk about um, this product since I'm wearing it um, for this look. Uh, I have three out of the four colors that kind of came in a set that I got at Christmas time. Um, it's Caprice, which is this bright color that I'm wearing. Um, Muse, which is this really beautiful um, blush kind of nudie color. And then Coral, which is this kind of soft peach. Um, I don't remember what the fourth color was. I think the fourth color was kind of like a bright corally kind of color. I'm not sure. I don't know where it is because I've never used it. Um, but these are the three colors that I have with me right now um, that I kind of use. And I will give you um, some color swatches. So this is the coral, which is a pretty bright color, I guess, on its own. But it's, it's soft. It's not quite as soft and as muted as it looks in the tube. It does come out a little bit brighter. Um, this is the color that I'm wearing. This is Caprice. It's going to look a little different here because I do have a gloss over the top of it on my mouth right now. But there's the Caprice. And then my favorite, Muse. Which is this like soft mauve blush color. It comes out a little bit darker and a little bit deeper in person than it does um, in a color swatch. Um, I love the colors. Like I really, really love the colors and I love how super pigmented they are. Literally, like you just want to you want to wipe all the excess off the, the tip um, before you put it on because um, it's super, super pigmented. Uh, the problem that I have with it is um, that it looks really chalky, I think, because of the really thick consistency of the product and then because it's so pigmented. So um, I try and wipe as much off of the tip applicator as I can, draw it on as sheer as I can, and then um, it looks more natural that way. But still, I don't like the way that it finishes. It kind of has a, like a dry, cakey kind of finish to it. It's very matte. So I always put some gloss over the top of it which unfortunately ruins the wear of the lip color. It's definitely not going to stay all day. As soon as I go and take a drink of something um, that comes right off, or like last night, um, I was wearing this one and I put some clear gloss over the top of it and totally forgot about it. When I went to kiss my son goodnight, I kissed him on the forehead and I kind of freaked out for a second because I didn't look at him right away, but like a few minutes later I looked and there was like this big, um, red mark on his forehead and I freaked out thinking that he had like smacked himself on something and then I realized oh hey that looks kind of like a lip and it's my lip because this lip color um, does not stay on once you put gloss on top of it so if you like that kind of um, really heavily pigmented matte kind of look you're probably gonna love these products um, this product I should say um, but for me I'm not a huge fan but then again when I put lip gloss on top of any regular lip color it's gonna come off anyways and I do find that the color really does last really well uh, it's just not going to be as lipstick and as pigment looking um, and it's not going to be wipe proof or transfer proof so that's my take on these colors uh, and that this product um, these are my three favorite ones. I'm not sure if they come in other colors. I'll have to look it out up online. Um, I buy all my stuff directly from Stila, so I always check their website for stuff. So there might be different things um, if they, I know they sell Stila at Sephora, but I recommend checking out their website directly. Um, so I hope you enjoyed the review, and uh, if it looks like a product that's going to work for you, run out and go get them. I'm not sure. Um, if they're available in that little four pack set um, or individually since I did get it at Christmas time. But um, really great. I love the color, uh, especially this one. It's very, very fun, very, very bright. I like bright colors. So 
Uh, I hope you enjoyed the tutorial. Uh, be sure to like the video if you liked it. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more uh, product reviews like this one. Uh, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.